Hello, my friends. It is so amazing to see you today. I hope your day has been fabulous. This is Mr. Jermail. I am coming at you today with a new modeling video because we are going to model one of my most favorite games, Measure Me. Oh, anybody know how to measure? Does anybody know what measuring even means? Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness, my friends. This is our game and the goal of our game for all of you who like to read our goals and who like to figure out what the game is about. This game will teach you how to compare and measure different things, whether something is love or short. Oh my goodness. Also, we're talking about measuring, estimating, and comparing. <gasps> measuring, estimating, and comparing. Oh my goodness, my friends, I am so excited. Okay, so first, we have so many different pieces to this amazing game. We have our creature pieces that we're going to use with all of our creatures that we are going to make. <gasps> oh my goodness, we have our spinner. Or we are going to spin to see if we're going to make something longer, equal to, or shorter. We have our cubes where we're going to measure with our cubes. We're going to put them together and see how many cubes it takes to measure something and what we're measuring with our cubes, if it's longer or shorter. And then we have our measuring graph. But we're going to actually get to graph what we have measured. Ah, oh my goodness, my friends. Okay, okay, I'm so excited, I'm so excited, I'm so excited. Okay, first, you're going to, you know what you're gonna do? Your first, which is our seed level. Remember, we have our seed, our sprout, and our bloom. Our first level, second level, third level, first level, we're going to first just start to explore all of the pieces. You get to look, you get to touch, you get to do things with the pieces, and nobody gets to tell you what to do. <laughs> Very fun! Now, we're going to make a creature. We're gonna make a creature with all of our creatures in front of us, and we're gonna talk about how long the creature is. So maybe we'll make this creature. Oh my goodness. We make this creature and talk about how long this creature is. Maybe a creature here. We start making our creatures and talking about how long our creatures are. Second, we are going to explore the game pieces again. And then we're going to make another creature friend. So let's make another creature friend. <gasps> okay, how about this creature friend? Okay, we've made this creature friend, right? Now we're going to spin to decide if the creature's friend that we're going to make, we're going to make this creature a friend. We're going to spin to decide if this creature's friend is going to be longer, shorter, or equal in length. Okay, let's, let's do it. Longer! So we're gonna make this person a friend or this creature a friend and it's gonna be longer than this. Let's see. Maybe if we do it like this, it will be longer. Is this longer? I think this one is longer than this one. Yes, my friends. Right now, we're gonna talk about the creature you made. Compare and measure your creatures using the cubes. Oh my goodness. And then we're gonna graph our results. So let's see. How do we know if this one's longer than this one? We're gonna use our cubes, so let's see. This one looks like it's one cube, two cubes, three cubes, four cubes long. Now this one looks like it's one cube, two cubes, three cubes, four cubes, five cubes, six cubes, seven cubes, eight cubes, nine cubes long. And this one is nine cubes long, and this one is four cubes long. Which one is the longest? The nine cubes long, yes, my friends. And we even get to grab it. So we can put it on our grab to determine which one is the longest. Oh my goodness, my friends. And now we go to our bloom game. So we have our seed, our sprout, and our bloom, our third level. Our third level, we're gonna explore again. And then we're gonna create another creature. 
but we're going to make three new creatures, okay? And then we're going to estimate how many cubes long each creature is. So we're going to estimate, we're going to make a guess about how long. So let's make three creatures. We have maybe keep our one, two, and then our three. Well, we actually can't keep it because we've got to determine how long they are. So let's do this, this, maybe put another creature here. Okay, I'm going to estimate. I'm going to make a guess. I think this creature is three cubes long. This creature is seven cubes long. And this creature is four cubes long. Ah, okay. Let's figure out how many cubes long. I said three, seven, and four. Let's see how many cubes long this one is. One, two, three, oops, four. I wasn't right. My estimation was a little off. Let's count this one. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine cubes long. Oh, okay. I wasn't right there either. How many cubes long is this one? One, two, three, four, five, six cubes long. Oh my goodness. Now we'll talk about the creature that we made and we're gonna order them from longest to shortest. I say we put them on our graph from longest to shortest. So it looks like this one was the longest. So let's put this one on our graph. Oh my goodness. Put this one on our graph. And then we put all of these on our graph. We've counted them out. Then we're gonna put this one right here because this is the second longest. And then this one, my friend, is the shortest with four. Look at our graph. Oh my goodness, my friends. Oh my goodness, oh my goodness. Looks like we are done. We went through our first, our second, and our third levels of game, our seed, sprout, and our bloom. Oh my goodness, my friend. Now it's time to go. I know, I know, I know, I know, but before I go, I wanna sing you a song. Can I sing you a song? It was like this. Bye bye, so long to you, my friends. Goodbye for now, until we meet again. Bye bye for now, until we meet again.